call on whether the state's minimum wage should be increased from $8.25 an hour to $10 an hour. The referendum is being backed by the current governor. Oh, shit, the minimum election. wage. And finally, the alleged shooter that killed a high school senior anticipating graduation was apprehended late Monday night and is now in custody. If convicted, he will be tried as an adult. Gun sale regulations in the city restricting retailers were approved by the Be sure to mention your years on the basketball team. And let them hey, know that you quit because you needed to help at home. Okay, mom. Hey guys, what's up? This is a game called We Are Chicago. I was sent a code by I think, I don't know if it was the developers or the PR. It was someone, someone from their team sent me it. And I don't normally play a lot of games where I get sent codes. I get sent so many and most of the games aren't that great. But this was a game about the Chicago inner cities and from the Chicagoland area. So I really wanted to play this. I, like in college, I spent a lot of time researching the inner cities of Chicago, so it's just something I have interest in. Uh, they did note that some of, some of their developers were from the South Side, so I like that. Okay, Mom! All right. Let's see, where's Mom? Ooh, making food. Hell yeah. Hell motherfucking yes. Two men who spent the last 13 years in prison had their murder Son, when you vacancies. finished, I could use One some help with dinner. Lock up in another city at the okay, time okay. Lewis, All right, reclaim our kids. Oh, this is, a, um, yeah. This is an actual program. All right, new enrolling students. Let's do this. Nice, I think that's a keeper. Oh, are there no voices? Or is that me? Someday you'll have to pay for me to take your picture. Don't worry, I got your good side. I got your good side. Oh, I like that cash, though. <laughs> yeah, well, right there now, I'd pay you to stop. Hey. <laughs> that's a good one. All right. Ah, that's a good one. Right. <laughs> Man, it wasn't all that funny. <laughs> I'll heh. I'll give a heh. Damn, there goes the bill. You guys are still down for the park after school, right? Sure. All right. Sounds good. All right, so Later. we are Aaron. That's why there was no voice. Oh shit, who's this? You do. You cause part of the stones. You gonna diss the man or else? Oh fuck, uh, uh, fuck. I, I ain't about nothing. You better watch yourself. I ain't about nothing, okay. Fuck's sake. Oh, everyone went to school. Man, what am I gonna do? Them bangers are all cowards, so I know they ain't gonna come at me one on one. And what if they decide to shoot at me? How is Taylor going to get along without me around? Who will help mom take care of her while I'm off at school? Justin thinks that because Robert's not as aggressive as his brothers, that Robert's soft. Only thing kids in the lily white suburbs got to worry about is what color to dye their hair. We gotta worry about staying alive. Wait, this is my quiz? <laughs> Fuck, <laughs> I don't know the answers. I'm gonna go, how is Taylor going to get along without me around? Oh, that's interesting. Okay, so obviously that's not our fucking quiz. <laughs> he can't focus on the quiz because he's at you know, I don't know, people threatening to kill him. If they run up on me while I have Taylor with me, how do I keep her safe? I have to do well in the finals so that I can earn a scholarship to college because mom can't afford the tuition. Financial aid, woo! Get it. Get the hell out of that financial aid. Next time Justin starts giving Robert a hand, well, you gotta pay back the loans though. <laughs> Shit. Next time Justin starts giving Robert a hard time, I should tell him to stop. Robert tries to put on a good face. Wow, there's literally a different gang every three or four blocks. This is some serious stress. Just getting to school safely. I'll choose that. Um, whoop. We're getting all the math questions wrong. Fuck. This is crazy. How can I be held accountable for decisions my cousin made? These idiots can't hear reason, so maybe I should throw the first punch before they unload on me. I don't want mama to have to keep working, so I need a profession, not a job. Professions pay more and a college will get me a profes profession. 
We all got hard lives. I think all of us thinks the others got it easy. I think that's like actually a really good point. I think that's a lot of that going around lately. It's bad enough that we have to deal with transitioning from childhood to adulthood, like kids in suburbia, but we also have to worry about just making it to school without getting shot. I'm gonna say that. I don't know if I made the right choice. I didn't show all side with them. Now I am a target. Sometimes I heard people saying that even college won't get you a better job, and I worry. Justin's gonna get enough of messing with Robert one day. Robert's gonna snap and wild out on his butt. If I stick to the streets, I'll have a better chance of avoiding the four two-legged dogs. I'm gonna say, sometimes I heard people say, please concentrate in the future, Aaron. All right, I'm sorry. I got shit going on with my life. Fuck. Don't forget the last chapter of homework is due tomorrow. Can I have extra credit? I'm just gonna go through your notes, try and find answers to everything. Math review, pep talk, cap and gown, pick up. Hello. Ooh. I thought that said spank Kiana for a second. I was like, what? <laughs> the hell this shit turned around fast. It does not say that. Why do we even have to take math? We'll never use it. Oh yeah. Why do we even have to take math? We'll never use it. I can't wait to leave for college. The best thing about LA is it ain't Chicago. <laughs> I hope I live long enough for my mama to see me walk across that Aww. stage. Fuck. It, it really breaks my heart, uh, the issue Chicago has. Uh, I mean, these are, these aren't, this isn't the whole city. It's a nice city, uh, but we do have neighborhoods where the socioeconomic stress over years, institutional racism over years has created a sort of culture that really hurts those people living in that neighborhood. And yeah, it, it breaks my heart. It's yeah, a really, thing. it's a hard thing to solve. I am glad it's finally over. Uh, Walker teaches English, right? Why is Mrs. Walker's class so bad? I just don't have time, you know, with looking after my mom. Yeah. We've been working a lot of shifts lately, man. I feel like I see you more than my mom. Well, maybe take some time off work. Finals are coming up. I could take some shifts. I'm trying to work more. Um, I mean, I need to study too, but I'll do it for you, buddy. <laughs> yeah. I guess I'll have to. You just need to find a shift. I'm not already working with you. Oh, shit. I'm taking Taylor to the park. My mom worries when I do. I'm taking Taylor to the park. You got any brothers or sisters at home? Oh, yeah. Taylor's your sister that you talk about at work. Did something happen at the park? When I was really young, my mom and I were at the park and a bunch of idiots started shooting at each other. My mom grabbed me and ran and we made it out fine, but she didn't take me to the park after that. That's rough, man. I want Taylor to be strong and not be afraid of the park. Them gangbangers shouldn't feel like they won. My pops used to tell me that fear was false evidence appearing real. <laughs> I like that. Uh, I want, I want to, uh, I'm gonna go with them gangbangers shouldn't feel like they won. Don't let them think that. It would only make things worse. Aggression ain't nothing but false pride. Cause real pride wouldn't take away from someone else's, would it? Pride goeth before a fall, so maybe you onto something. I want Taylor to be strong, not be afraid of the park. Oh, okay. Let's just say everything. Strength only goes so far by itself. This is very inspirational. I just worry what's gonna happen when I'm not here for her. What do you want for your sister? It's my job to make sure she gets a chance at something better. I hear you. James noticed your negativity, okay. Ready to get out of here. All right, I gotta go pick up my sister. I guess now is the best time to do my homework, right? Do it. Well, you wanna hang? I'm picking up my sis, and then we're gonna meet my sister, uh, meet my friends at the park. Sure, sounds cool. Yeah, let's go. I'm oh, sorry, I didn't mean to like shove my face in your face and make out. Oh, okay, that's locked. Let's look around really quick, see if there's anything else we could miss. Hey, Tamika, you and Crystal going to the party this Friday? I don't know, Troy. My girl told me them gangsters might show up there. How she know they coming? Her boyfriend is one of them. Sorry. I'm so sorry to intrude. Don't text and drive. 
Dude, that's for real too. Don't text and drive. We're getting life lessons from this shit. Don't fucking text and drive. Care about your education as best as you can. I mean, even if you don't plan to go to college or anything like that, there's a whole internet, there's libraries with tons of knowledge that will give you good skills in life. Because I'm going to be real. I went to college. I'm not using my degree. I could use it. Um, but I, you know, I learned a bunch of stuff off the internet and... Oh, we can talk to Aunt Andre now. I'm gonna join the army and travel around the world. Okay. Hey, Aaron. Hey. Do they say different things? Hey, Aaron. Okay, no, they don't. Martin Luther King. Reading is awesome! Dude, reading is awesome, though. Oh, shit. Hell yeah. What do we got? Dill chips, BBQ, blue chips. Fuck blue chips. Fuck, I don't have money, do I? God damn it. All right, you got any money? Yo. Okay. Please. School's over. Get out of here. Okay. What you got there? What are her documents about? Don't mind me, officer, just snooping. Alright, bye. Get out of here. Hey girls. I can't dialogue with you. Okay. Nice shoes though. Nice booties. Malcolm X. I'm okay again. You have a committee meeting this Friday. All right, let's go through the metal detector. Ready to go? Let's head outside. Let's do this. Man, it's crazy that we've been at well, this. Oh. Think about it like this. You're way more likely to introduce yourself to a female than a dude. I'll introduce myself to anyone worth it. <laughs> right. The only guys I know at school Besides you, are the ones I played on the baseball team with. You're on the baseball team? We should cross so we don't run into any trouble, man. Oh, God. Uh, 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 there's like foreboding music. Go. Man. Was on the baseball team. I played through sophomore year, then I had to start helping with the bills. Yeah. Aaron, wait, <laughs> are we just gonna walk in the hey, middle of the road? How'd y'all first meet? Hey, those are good friends. I've moved. No, actually, so no, multiple people who've been you know hit saying? by cars in gang related incidents. What is this? No, you did not go in the middle of the road, bad. Maybe I'll go online and look up a couple people. Soon as I get finals and graduation behind me. Right now, I'm hearing that the Disciples and the Stones are recruiting and shooting. I hope things don't get worse. How about you? You ain't gonna have no trouble graduating, are you? I'm passing all my classes. I'm doing as best I can. I'm doing as best I can. <laughs> That's good to hear. Not to stroke your ego or nothing, but you one of the smartest dudes Thanks, I know. Thanks, James. You're a sweetheart. I hope the college admission people think I'm good enough to get in. It's a good thing to be humble, but you can't judge smarts by grades. Yeah, they shouldn't only judge you by your grades. I feel like I'm going to get stuck if I don't get accepted by a good school. Feels like some faceless they is deciding my future. Who the heck is they? The, the fucking elites, guys? James! The psychic vampires, James! Hillary Clinton, James! Donald Trump, James! Them! They! So how old is this little genius you've been bragging on? Nine going on ten. She should be out here soon. Hey. Aaron. Aaron. This is James. Hey, Tater Todd. How was your day? Great. I got a gold star on my homework you helped me with last night. Who's this? Oh, don't brag about your gold star. Because look, guess who didn't get a fucking gold star? 
This is James from work. James, this is my sister Taylor. Good job on your homework. This is James. Hello, Taylor. It's nice to finally meet you. Your brother talks about you all the time. Hi. <laughs> We should walk to the to the other side of the street. Um oops. Thanks. I didn't get that one in time. So alright, proceed to the middle of the street, sister. We are still going to the park, aren't we, Aaron? Of course we're all going to the park. Yay! I should have known you would keep your word. I can't wait to play on the merry go round. And to swing. It seems like we haven't been to the park since forever. I guess last week is forever in kids' years. Kid I'm years. You, Taylor. When I was your age, I couldn't get enough of the park either. Don't you still love it? Yeah, I do, but probably not as much as you. Dude, swings, the slide when you're a kid. I don't think anyone loves the park as much as Taylor. Does. If they don't, they're losing out. Hell yeah. Don't be getting too far too far ahead, Taylor. <laughs> yes, let's please get out of the road. People will fucking hit you. They will speed up and fucking hit you. That's a thing too. Taylor, Aaron tells me that you're pretty good at science. Yeah, we looked at the epidermis under a microscope. It was weird. <laughs> well, I can't argue with you on that. What did you learn in school yeah, today, Taylor? We learned about Hannibal the Great. Ooh. What did they have to say about him? He said that Hannibal was a great general from Carthage in northern Africa, and he invaded Rome and captured it. How did he manage that? Hannibal was smart. He knew the Romans wouldn't be guarding the Alps because they thought that nobody could cross them. Looks like Justin and Rob are already here. They're cool. They must be, if you like them. Hey, fellas, what's up? This is James. What's going on, James? I've seen you at school. Hey, James, my name is Rob. And I'm Justin. Yo, what's up, fellas? Has it been quiet around here? Yeah, pretty quiet. That's good. Taylor, I can tell you're itching to go play. We'll be over here. I'll be keeping an eye on you. Don't fall on your face. So yeah, me and James work together. James goes to our school, still have issues with getting into college, Rob. I'm glad we can come out here every day after school. I'm just glad it ain't so bad I appreciate that they can come out here and play. Yeah. Me too. You both are pretty damn lucky. It was dangerous when we was her age. We didn't have someone watching over us. Yeah, I ain't heard of nothing happening here lately. Yeah, that's because the disciples got this hood now. Ain't nobody doing nothing. You don't know how many times I've been here and they came talking. Yeah, but you still ain't talking back, right? Those dudes ain't nothing but trouble. Don't get mixed up with them. Seriously, you know better than most. Yeah. Yeah, okay. It's just cool to not have somebody fighting here. Mm. They might be soon. It's too close to the stone. James goes to our school. Let's, like, topic change to my man James. Yeah, man. You, you got Mr. Scott for math, right? Man, that dude's so ancient. You probably seen me walking my girl to his class. Yeah, I had him last semester. Almost failed. What about English? I what can't look at my sister. Yeah, How do I know what's happening? She ain't all that bad. Other than all the homework. Rob can't write a passing paper to save his life. Damn, throwing shots at Rob. That's bullshit. She grades you on the dumbest stuff in her class. <laughs> yeah, right. Periods and other pointless things, right? I'm glad Justin said it. I was about to, but he took it for me. I don't want to be that big of a dick. Still having issues getting into college. Oh my god! Uh... Shoot, I even joined the military just to get away from all this crap. 
Nah, don't give up. I hear what you're saying, but I'm taking it one day at a time and doing whatever I have to do. You right about that. Ain't nobody got tomorrow promised. I guess I should get Taylor soon. It'll be getting dark. All right, what's new, Justin? I'm still trying to find a job. Is your place hiring? Mm, yeah, I can ask. Sure, if you could. Okay. I've Justin heard there are a couple places by Ethan's hiring too. Justin's family has a <laughs> kind of a reputation. Oh, I feel you. I had to deal with that myself trying to get a job. Wait, you're James Williams? That makes sense. What do you? Hey, big brother! Look at me! Look, I can swing really high. You go, Taylor. Man, watching your sis really takes me back. It's like your only job was to have fun. I want to swing. Thanks for helping watch her, guys. No problem. I wish somebody was there for me when I was younger. So about the job. Think you can at least ask? Justin, I told you I would ask. Yeah, you know I'll look out for you. Thanks. I guess I should get Taylor now. It'll be getting dark soon. We still meeting here tomorrow? Yeah, we're gonna be here. Home time, Tater Tot. Okay. Oh my god, I thought she was gone for a second. Later. Nice meeting y'all. Likewise, see you around. Yeah. Catch you later. I want to swing. Is James walking with us? From what you said, you ain't had a home cooked meal in a while. That's right. Mom loves to cook for company. Oh my god, where is my head going? Well, I'm not doing that. Guilty if I turn down such a great invitation. Oh, because I'm supposed to move. It. I was on like, well, I was on rails for a while where it moves for you. But now I'm free. I'm free. What is that? I didn't have that in my swing sets. Let's see if we can interact. Hey, see you tomorrow, man. Bye, Justin. Who's this girl? Okay. Oh fuck, where'd where'd my sister go? I've lost her. Stop the violence now. Missing. I want to see if I can see the skyline. Let's not take long. Mom may need our help. Plus. Oh. Worked up a big appetite. <laughs> mm -hmm, I bet. Taylor, you work up a big appetite doing crossword puzzles. Trying to eat my portion on top of your own. <laughs> I'm a healthy, growing girl, and I need my nourishment. Oh, if that's what you want to call it. Shoving all that food down your face. I think you got a tapeworm in your stomach. Oh, that tapeworm <laughs> shout out. Gross. Ah. Uh. I let my mom know, so I should be fine to stay over for dinner. <laughs> You'll like our place. I love it. And I would miss it if we ever left it. Oh, Anyone who's been to my live streams knows the tapeworms. A bed in my own bedroom. And more than one bathroom. I wish I had a dime for every minute I've spent waiting for the bathroom to be free. You ain't funny. Me and mom don't spend half as much time in there as oh. you do. Oh, really? Oh, motherfucking really, Taylor? That's right. Walk in the middle of the street. Lady doth <laughs> protest too much, me thinks. Wow, listen at you. Quoting from one of Shakespeare's plays. I'm impressed. Well, you knew who I was quoting. Big deal. Everybody knows who Shakespeare was. Oh, really, Taylor? You're going to give us the 411? I don't know about that, Taylor. I ain't never known nobody till just now. <laughs> When I read what the gangbangers write on the walls, half the time they can't even spell gangsters. And most of them in jail can barely read or write. Seems like without the proper education, people were already half dead. What's that saying? Education is the passport to the future. Yeah, 
Malcolm X. Mama still has Dad's picture of him. Your future is college, Aaron. Oh, thank you. I hope so, Taylor. Right again, Taylor. Of course I am. You're getting a little smug, though. We need you to tone it down. All right, are we? Oh, that's not our house. I think this is. Mom, you here? I don't think she's home yet. <gasps> I can't stay too long. Gotta get home soon to check on my mom. Mom, shouldn't be long. I'm gonna watch the news. I can never understand her fascination with the news. Yeah, I know what you mean. I usually end up pissed off or upset for the rest of the day. <laughs> yeah, make yourself at home. You want something to drink? Sure, I'll take some water. We got here. Wait, something at gun sales restriction, minimum wage. All right, stuff we heard earlier. Didn't James want something to drink? Okay, you know what, Taylor? Oh, girl, she's talking all that shit. Wait, hold up. I don't know. If I have anything to drink. Taylor, you want something? Okay, there we go. No, thank you. I still can't believe we live so close to each other this whole time. Well, it's not like I'm outside much. I guess we haven't hung out much True outside of work. That. It's nice out, but I keep but I worry about all the shootings that keep happening near school. I've been lucky so far. I haven't run into any of Tim's enemies. So far, that's good, right? It's been a few months since the last time, but luckily they just took my money. Sometimes they shoot you just for the hell of it. Stick with your friends for protection. Man, I've been thinking about getting a gun. Man, you're smarter than that. A piece didn't help Daryl. He got jumped just yesterday. Did they take anything from him? Nah, a cop saw them drag him to into an alley, so he broke it up. But dude still ended up in the hospital. And I refuse to be scared. I want to be able to get out of this neighborhood. I hope so. You worried about graduation? Nah, I think I'll be all right. But I just don't know what's next. Me neither. I'm hoping to get into college, but... Who knows if there'll be any jobs when I'm done. Same here. I'm just hoping all the advertising for city colleges wasn't just hype. There are always jobs for smart people. I like that. Man, I refuse to be scared. You finished with your water? Yeah. Give me the Thanks. fucking cup! Let me show you around. Sure. Right here, I think, is uh, me and my sister's room. This is where she's always talking shit to me. Wednesday, 15th June. Had another dream going to Chicago for summer. Vacation from Atlanta. I wish the kids could have had fun like we had. Oh, George, why? Get out of here. The bathroom. Wash my face. Gotta have a clean face. Back door. Then this is mom's room. That's mom and Taylor. Oh no, this is our room. Never mind. Okay, so mom and Taylor sleep together. I guess that makes sense. 
Nice stars. Oh, hell yeah, yes, yeah, the stars. I have the fucking stars in my room at you my parents' house. Messy? Hell yeah. I'd hate for you to see my room, but trust me, yours is a lot cleaner. Yeah, well, I wish you'd tell my mom that. Yeah, this isn't actually that dirty. She swears I've got the worst kept room in all of creation. Stuff looking out for family. Man, I know you must lose a lot of sleep trying to take care of your sister. Nah, she's just excitable, you know? She's got big dreams. Hey, some dreams are worth holding on to. I really want her to do well at school. I try and help her when I can. Speaking of dreams, I'm dreaming that we will have dinner soon. <laughs> That's good for the shorties. They need to see that kind of thing. Yeah. If more people helped. So here's, so yeah, here's my place. So we should probably check on Taylor. Yeah. What's she up to? Sure. Yeah. Probably about to talk sure. shit to us. All right, he will remember our talk. Did you show James our stars in your room? Yes. So epic. Hey, funny face, what's up? Whose face you calling funny? I'm just watching the news. Do you want me to watch the news with you? Nah, James is over. It's okay. Mm -hmm. Why did you watch the news? Why do you watch the news so much? So I can know things. Well, uh, fake news. Taylor, tater tot, you gotta beware the fake news. You could watch something else. It's just plain depressing. Yeah, it's always poor people in other places. My teacher says it's important for a person to be well informed. And besides, what if someone I know is on? You should just be praying that that don't happen because it's never good. Your teacher is right, except who decides what's news? You never see any stories about the positive things. Who decides what's news? Anyway, I like the news, and I'm going to keep on watching it. Fine, Taylor. Let the elites brainwash you. <laughs> All right, did Mom say anything about being late? How did your math class go today? It was great. We're subtracting decimals. Ugh. You know, the way you love math makes me wonder if you weren't switched at birth. Keeping up with your fractions homework? Uh-oh. <laughs> Keep it I up. Hate fractions. There it goes. Oh, I love them. Numbers are so final. There's always one right answer. Wait until you learn about imaginary numbers. Huh? <laughs> How'd you do on your test? I did okay. I missed a few questions, but I got a 94. A 94. Taylor's mad because she only got a 94. You know, I rarely get 90s anymore. Taylor, you should be happy. I know, I know. That's what he says. But I just want to do my best. Hope mom gets home soon. I'm starved. Oh. Hey, there's mom. Hi, mama. How was your day? Hey, mom. Hello, Taylor. Hello, Aaron. Who's this young man? This is James, mom. We work together at Ethan's. Remember I told you about him? Oh, yes, you did. Nice to finally meet you, James. Aaron has told me good things about you. Nice to meet you, Ms. Davis. I've heard good things about you, too. Well, consider yourself at home. I didn't bring home anything too fancy, but we should have dinner ready soon. Yay! To the left sink when you're ready to make some pasta. Pasta, pasta, yeah, pasta, I'm pasta. Starving. Let's go. Oh, let's move out the way, fucking table. James, out the fucking way. Taylor, out the way. I'm getting this pasta. Start helping. All right, everyone. Dinner is almost ready. As soon as I finish slicing this onion for the salad, we can get started. I'll set the table, Mom. Mama, I don't know how you cut those onions without crying. She has no don't soul. Don't you remember what I told you? The secret is running cold water while you're cutting them. My mother taught me the same thing, Miss Davis. Mama is the best cook in the whole 
world. That's true, though, if you don't want to cry. Ava, I'm Sometimes sure I like crying when I cut onions. Cook too. I know that's right, Mama, because James don't look like he's missed any meals. Oh, she does. Let's just say my mom knows her way around the kitchen. Can you get the plates out first? Then we'll start serving. You want me to set out the salad bowls, Mom? No, Aaron. We can just put the salad on the side next to the pasta. I'm gonna need a bowl, Mama. You know I can't stand for my foods to be touching. Oh my God, you're a food toucher person, Taylor. Taylor, I keep telling you that your foods are gonna be Maybe touching so, anyways. But not on my plate. Who wants their salad all soggy with spaghetti that sauce? It makes it taste better. You're missing Would out. Would you two just quit it? You keep on like that, and James will get the idea that you two don't like one another. Of course you can use a bowl and toss it, Taylor. Don't worry, Miss Davis. They're making me feel right at home. They remind me of me and my sister. Uh -oh. Look at me being all responsible, setting a table. Sorry, I think I missed some dialogue. My bad, my bad. Alright, are we good? No, we need forks and knives. And the game froze for a second. It'll probably doing this occasionally. There it goes. Alright. Wait, I got everything. Do you need any help? Nothing, so I got it. It's just one table to set. Wait, I still do got this fucking cup. Sorry, Mom, I hit you in the face with the cup. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. Oh. Hey, give me all this. Um, shit. Bad enough. Maybe I can come back. I'll come back. Y'all, wash your hands. We'll eat any minute now. My hands are lies. already clean. Girl, you better wash your Absolute hands. Absolute lies. That's why she's lying. She's watching all that fake news. Mama, tell this boy he better stop calling me a witch. I'm sure your brother didn't do it that way, Taylor. Okay. And it's at the table. Dinner's ready. Come sit down and let's bless the food. Bow your heads. Everyone bow your heads. Dear Lord, we thank you for the meal we are about to receive. And we thank you for life, family, and friends. Amen. Amen. Was Get the fuck down. Time? Everyone stay seated and don't go near the window. Local idiots are at it again. Are you okay? I'm... I'm okay. It's just a shame that we can't enjoy our dinner in peace. Well, we're all okay, so let's just enjoy our dinner. Thanks, Aaron. Do you think anyone got shot? I hope to God that nobody got shot. We hear shots all the time, but we don't hear police sirens half as much. You think it's safe? I think so. As safe as it can be. I don't know about you walking home, James. Well, if it happens again, I'll call my mom. You can spend the night if you need to. Let's just see what happens. All right, let's try and finish this up like a normal dinner. Um, the food is very good, ma'am. Thanks for letting me stay for dinner. Thank you, and you're welcome. Hey, bro, it's about time I headed home. I don't want to be too late or my moms will get worried. Want me to walk you halfway? No, I'm good. Let me grab my bag. <laughs> I'll wait a while. You waited a minute. I'm gonna go <gasps> start my homework. Aaron, can I talk to you? Okay, mom. So what did I do? Yeah, ma. Uh, what's up, mom? I haven't done anything wrong. <laughs> I don't think it's such a good idea. You hanging around oh, James right. outside of work. Why not? Ain't he one of the brothers of that poor little girl who was shot a couple years ago? I don't want you caught up in the middle of all that gang shooting. 
Mom, you ain't gotta holler at me besides James is my boy. Mama, I'm 18. When you gotta, you, when you gonna stop treating me like a child? He ain't involved with no gang even though his brother is, but James ain't with that. That may be, but like your daddy used to say, bullets ain't got no name on them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Mom, but Pops would say when a friend needs help, you gotta help. What kind of friend would I be if I stopped hanging with James because so, somebody got beef with his brother? What about Taylor? Do you want to put her in harm's way? Mm -hmm. Promise me at least that you won't hang around with him when Taylor's with you. Okay, Mom, I can do that. I'm going to go to bed early tonight. It's been a long day. Thanks for dinner, Mom. Well, see James to the door. I love you, and I just don't want to see nothing bad happen to you. Yeah, I love you too, Mom. Everything's going to be all right. Okay. I didn't even eat my spaghetti, though. What's in here? Oh. Hey, tell your mom thanks again for- Yep, see you tomorrow, James. Lock the door. James, are you okay out there? All right, he's fine. We'll go to sleep. My stars! We need to turn the light off though, so they can glow in all their glory. Wake up. Something terrible has happened. What, what's wrong, Mom? Is Taylor all right? Well, what's wrong, Mom? Are you hurt? No, son. I am fine. Your cousin Dion is in the hospital. He was shot, but he's okay. Where'd he get shot? I, I don't know where he was at, but he was shot in the leg. Do they know why he got shot? I don't have any more details. Is Aunt Kayla okay? Kayla's about to lose her mind and I can't blame her. You be extra careful today. Dory Mom will take good care of Taylor. I know you will, son. You always do. I don't know what I would do without you. Now I gotta get going or I'll be late for work. I love you, son. Bye-bye. Love you, too. Okay. Shit. All right, let's go. You okay, cuz? Right. I think, are we just leaving? Don't forget to wake up Taylor and drop her off. Okay. Don't forget to wash up. All right, I guess I'll wash myself before school if it's a fucking must. Yeah, you need to wake the fuck up. Talking all that shit. I'm gonna talk shit now. It ain't so loud anymore. Do I need to take a fat shit? No, nah, we don't need to take a fat shit. Are you awake? Oh, she better be awake. Okay. Homework folder. You almost... Okay, no, she hasn't grabbed her bag yet. I read the note Mom left. She said I can't leave without you today. Want to sit? Yeah, I'll sit. You should never go by yourself. Last of all today. I got some bad news, Taylor. 
Oh no, is Mama okay? It's Cousin Dion. He was shot last night. He was shot in the leg. Oh no, is he alright? He's okay. What's okay mean? He's not in the ER, that means his condition is stable. Mom figured you would try to leave without me. But I know you would never do that. Oh, or you would, would you? Yeah. Is it? <sighs> so mom was right. I'm a big girl. I can take care of myself. No. I know you can, but you should let me help as long as I can. Yeah, well, I want this. Yeah, but I can always run away. Don't you think Dion tried to run? You can't stop a bullet. Don't ever leave without me. Mom and I couldn't take it if something happened. I just don't want to lose my favorite little sister. <laughs> That's because I'm your only sister. Yeah, I got stuck with shit talking you. <laughs> I like Taylor. She's wild as fuck. All right, hold on. Who the fuck is this? Morning, how's it going? Ah. Uh, morning. Ah. Uh, I heard about what happened. Figured you might want some company walking in. Fuck. But mom said no. How? Well, my friend, Clyde, he was out with your cousin. He was fine, but he, he was pretty shaken up. Hmm. He called me to tell me this morning, and he said your cousin got it worse. What happened? Let's walk to school with Taylor and talk. No. Mama said no. Taylor, you ready yet? Wow, we did not give a shit about what our mom yeah. said. <laughs> All right, come on, Taylor. We're walking with James. All right, let's go. Sorry, Taylor, I'm a little on edge. I didn't sleep well last night. I'm... Do you think we're safe? We'll be extra careful. These streets is definitely not safe to walk at night, but we should be okay right now. I know y'all are saying that for me, but you're worried just like I am. Damn. We're not worried. Last night, my boy Clyde and Dion was just in the wrong place at the wrong time. Well, I guess you got a point. Sure, I'm right. Uh -oh. Rob. Hey man, I can't make it to the park today. Well, that's too bad. Okay, why? You said you would help me keep an eye on Taylor. I got something else I gotta do. Okay. What do you have to do? Now be careful, okay? Got their school. I will if you will. Bye bye, big brother. Bye bye, James. Bye. Bye, Taylor. See you later. You forgot your homework folder and your backpack. Great. What is she doing? I knew I should have wow. reminded her. That is one smart kid. Now, what did your boy Clyde have to say? Man, like I said, he was shook up pretty bad, and he ain't no punk. Let's go over to the other side. Man. James will remember this.
Look left. Look right. Now cross. He said they was just walking along Good when teenagers. all of a sudden a bullet whizzed right past his head. He heard your cuz scream. He ended up getting hit. I give him a lot of credit. The average dude would have cut out on your cuz. We saw two dudes in black hoodies, but couldn't see their faces. Did he think they were was after him or after Dion? Yeah, he is too. I know him through my brother. So you know the name of that song. All right, school, is this school? I think this is school. This is school. I hope this close call I wakes my cousin my up. I've seen my father have more than one close call and it never woke him up, but I hope it works for your cuz, man. I really do. Thanks, James. Yeah, let's hope. Yeah. Later, Aaron. Bye. Wait, isn't he going to school too? Hey, girls. Hey, Aaron. Yo. They know my name. Oh, yeah, I got it. If you're going to be working on that, can I borrow your history book? Okay, my book's in my locker. I'll get it later. Look, if I don't find what I'm looking for in the book, will you help me? <laughs> sure, you've been pulling A's and trick, ain't you? I could use a little help with that. Oh, no problem. That's my strong suit. So, Brianna, how's your French? Excelente, mon beau frère. Excelente. Wait, excelente? Excellent. It's what? Wait. I don't know. I know French. I just don't know that. Well, I don't know French. I'm okay. We still going to the show Friday, right? Yeah, as long as you get your daddy's car. I don't know. The bus is still run, though. You kidding? The way these fools shooting? I ain't standing on no bus stop. I'll do Get my the best. car, man. Get the car. Okay, I'll leave you girls alone. Somebody else got shot last night. How many is that this month? I ain't sure, but I count 14 since Friday. Damn. Mr. Davis, thank you for honoring us with your presence. All right, the bell just rang. I was close. We will continue with our workbook. Yo, Sean, you passed the corner store on your way to school today? Yeah, man, I saw them teddy bears and flowers there. Who got popped? I don't know. I just heard that somebody did a drive-by and killed one dude. They say it was the disciples. They need to tell the cops what they know. Yeah, then who's going to protect the one who tells? The police? I don't know, Troy, but I know what's gonna happen if nobody tells. Man, if them dudes were stay in their own hood. You make it sound like they was justified. I ain't saying that, but them bangers be dealing in somebody else's hood. They know what's up. Them bangers don't care if they hit innocent men, women, or children. I heard the disciples on a recruiting drive expanded their territory. I wish more of y'all would have the guts to stay away from them gangs. Yeah, well, them bangers ain't recruiting y'all females. But we can't hardly get to school or home without somebody up in our face. That's right, and they don't be shooting at y'all neither. Oh, and I suppose we women ain't a part of the hood. They just recruit us in a different way. They try to buy us. True that, but still, we under constant pressure. We try to do what's right, but we a target for the gangs. Yeah, and then the cops see us and say we gangsters anyway. That's right, bro. We damned if we do and damned if we don't. I ain't saying it's easy, Troy. I'm saying it's necessary. All right, now, that sounded deep, but what did it mean? That's simple, Sean. People got to do something. Yeah, well, maybe you should be telling that to John. All right, interesting dialogue. Man, I don't know how James deals with Layla's being killed. If anything ever happens to Taylor, I'll just die. The average person would use the adversity that James has been through as an excuse for failure. Dad and Mom both inspired me to do well, but James is truly self-motivated. James is the baddest dude I know. This brother has survived things that would cripple just about anybody else. Let's see that one. 
Mom won't complain, but sometimes I hear her crying at night. She really misses Dad. Someday I'll do something to make Mom really proud of me. Mom never gives up, so neither will I. I know Mom must be lonely, but she refuses to put another man in Dad's place over Taylor and me. I'm gonna go, Mama never give, or Mom never gives up, so neither will I. Taylor's too young to remember Dad, so it's up to me to remind her of the man he was. I must stay strong, not just for myself, but for Taylor. I've got to be a stronger influence on Taylor than the streets. If I go to college, I'll have to stay in the city so I can look after Taylor. I've got to be a stronger influence on Taylor than the streets. I think that, I, it's, sometimes it's hard to tell which one you're selecting. Taylor's really smart. Even if I don't go to college, I'll make sure that she goes. At least Justin will be at the park with Taylor and I. I don't know what's going on with Robert. His text this morning was weird. Let's talk about Robert. Um, Aaron, you won't get far with grades like these. I tried. I tried. Class is over. Get going home now. You have extra credit yet? Sorry, I think I hopped on your desk. All right, we're out of here. We're free. Freedom. Yo, Chris, you've seen just Robin Justin? Not really. What do you mean? Look here. I know those are your homies, but you might want to give your boy some F for a while. That's what's real. I can't give them air. They're my friends. I don't want to get in all of it now, right now, but just take my word for it. Things could get ugly. Okay. I don't know. It didn't, he didn't say it. Thanks anyway. Shit. Sorry, see, she's just showing off to me today. I don't show off. I'm a gymnast. <laughs> where are Robert and Justin? They sick? I don't know where they are. They skipped out early. Maybe they had to go to work. I don't. Th I don't think so. Why? What's wrong? Remember what mom, what mom said about talking to strangers? I think they might have gotten involved with the wrong crowd. You talking about the gangs? Yeah, but don't tell mom, though. Hmm. Okay. But you owe me. Thanks, sis. I don't think she will tell on us. Right. Why couldn't James come with us? Didn't mom tell you she didn't want you hanging around James? Yeah, but I like James. What's wrong with him? Mom made me promise when James came over for dinner. Oh, then you broke your promise this morning when we walked with James. All to right, school? look, Taylor. I didn't see a way I could keep it and get us to school. Why would Mama make you promise that? She's afraid that you'll talk my friends to death. <laughs> Mom's just afraid you've been spending too much time around boys. Mama didn't say that. <laughs> she didn't, I agree. You are so silly. You little skank. You going to you you going to come to my graduation next weekend? Yes. I asked Mama about it. I'm so excited to see you walk. Thanks. I know it'll make Mom proud. It makes me proud too. Oh. I have a high school graduate for a brother. Oh. Thank you, Taylor. You're being nice today. It will give you a better oh, future. Yeah. After you graduate college and get an awesome job. I hope so. I'll need to do well in college. I heard Mama talking with Auntie Kayla. She thinks you'll get into a good school. Or you could just bullshit your way to the top, honestly, Taylor. No, wait. Look, Mom worries about you. James just has a bad history. Sorry, I've worked today. We can't stay long. How was school today? Um, it was okay. I got some homework to do. Can I use your computer? Sure, Tater Tot. Thanks. Also, we have a test Monday. Can you help me study this weekend? 
Mm-hmm. We'll have you ace that test. Better than a 94. 94 unacceptable. All right, look, Mom worries about you. James just has a bad history. Bad? Yeah, he had... Oh, I don't want to say that. I don't want to scare her. Something bad happened to his family. Oh, I can't believe James would have let something like that happen. Just wrong place. He had some not so good what associations. Did she didn't want either of us hanging with James. She said, oh, no, no, I'm just Oh. Well, Mom doesn't have to know. That would be wrong, and I already promised Mom. Okay. Sorry, I have to work today. We can't stay long. You know. Thanks for bringing me to the park. Mm-hmm, high five. Thanks for coming with me. All right, that's my alarm for work. Uh, do we have to? Mm-hmm, yes we do. Let's go. Uh-oh, what's happening? What's happening? Nothing's happening. Taylor, we gotta go. Taylor, Taylor. Taylor? Are you gonna get off that swing or are you just gonna passive aggressively look at me? I think there's an issue. Um, all right guys, I'm gonna end the game here. I can't get out of this. She's been staring at me, staring me down. I get a good thumbnail from this though. I wish I could zoom out a little bit just to catch. Oh, there it is. On my way to work, meet you there. Right, Will's gonna be there so don't be late. This is from James. Oh, hey, shit. Late. Actually, I've been recording for a really long time, so you got, do you guys want me to continue this game? I'm enjoying it so far. It's a nice change of pace from, like, you know, just it's petty, petty drama, like, you know, why are you wearing the same clothes as me? Um, and I've just, there hasn't been a lot of, a whole lot of games out lately that I've been interested in. So, yeah, I've been looking for newer shit, but it's just that time of the year where Christmas was just over, so there's not a whole lot of new releases, but... Uh, this is interesting so far. All right, guys, have a great night and bye.